Welcome to this video on uh, gland packing. Uh, in particular, we're looking at the uh, lantern ring. So having a look at this pump, it's a uh, horizontally split pump. And we've got our suction coming in here through the middle. And then the, the casing splits that water and it enters into the impeller on the right hand side and on the left hand side and then get us expelled as a impeller rotates around inside the housing and that's your discharge around there and as you can see we've got a from the casing we're piped out and down into where the gland is we've got that's our bearings there supporting the shaft we've got the the gland with the adjusting nuts on it We've got the stuffing box, and then we've got two rounds of packing, three, three rounds of packing close to the impeller, and then we have the brass ring there in the middle, and that's a lantern ring. That's a loose fit around the shaft and into the stuffing box. The purpose of the, the lantern ring is, as the pump rotates and expels the water, the high pressure is bled off, down through there and by cavities down in through the pump housing it reaches the lantern ring and uh, with the recesses and the holes that are in the lantern ring it allows the water to circulate around that. In this case we've got three rounds of packing then the lantern ring then two rounds of packing. It's important that the lantern ring be positioned if we're packing the gland that is positioned in the correct place opposite the hole that's drilled into the casing so that the water comes down into it. And if we have a look at this gland it looks like it could move the lantern ring could move down one round of packing so maybe two rounds of packing then the lantern ring then three rounds of packing would be a better uh, installation than what we have there now. What the, the lantern ring is trying to seal, or what the gland is trying to seal, is water trying to escape along the shaft and water trying to escape around the, the packing and down through the stuffing box. So as the water is coming from the lantern ring and forcing its way back along the, the packing, it acts as a wet seal. Also, the, the water coming through there serves to uh, cool down the pump because it can get quite hot, especially if the packing is a bit dry and been used for quite some time. It also acts as a lubricant. Uh, the packing does have grease impregnated into it, but as that dries out, of course, you've got the water there and that helps to lubricate it too. So a lantern ring does three things. It uh, helps to seal, helps to seal the uh, stuffing box. It helps to cool down the gland and the shaft and it helps to lubricate it as well. And sometimes it's necessary to feed the lantern ring from an external source a source, especially if the uh, the water that's being pumped is contaminated, gritty substance or something like that. Because if it's gritty, it's going to act as a grinding paste when it gets between the shaft and the, the rounds of packing. So it may be necessary to feed the lantern ring from a, an external source so that the water is clean and so on. Here we are just having a closer look at the lantern ring and you can clearly see uh, the holes in the middle of it that allows the water to circulate through it. You can see too that in diameter it's smaller than the packing. You can see the cavity there in which the water comes fed down into the pump and then through a hole around the lantern ring and of course the water then gets forced in two directions. It gets forced towards the impeller and also towards the uh, gland. Here's another type of pump and uh, we can see the shaft there and we got the two uh, the bearing housing and the bearings that support an overhung shaft in this case we have a slinger there that's just a rubber washer type of element which is put onto the shaft and stops the water that might escape from the uh, impeller housing stops it from traveling along the shaft and entering into the uh, bearing housing we have the gland there and we have the packing three rounds of packing and uh, and a lantern ring assembly just up close to the impeller in this case. 